Is being fat a choice? No. Hey, this is no hate, but I have a question. Why are you only talking to thin people about fat bodies? Like, how does that make sense? Really, I'm actually curious. Because the math ain't mathing. I didn't know that you could pack so much stupidity into a 20 second clip. And she was only talking for 10 seconds of it. Do I have to ask a fat person about what it means to be fat and if it's wrong? Are they the only people that can give you an accurate answer? I don't know, because if he was just going and only asking skinny people, then it does, it makes it irrelevant. It, no, it does You doesn't. should be asking everyone. Being fat, objectively, is unhealthy, right? I'm not shaming anyone in saying that, but objectively, we know it's yeah. unhealthy. It's what, like, I'm, not, I'm not taking into account your personal circumstances, what got you down there. The bottom line is, is that it's unhealthy to be fat, which means it's not good to be fat. Yeah, but his question was, is being fat a choice? Now, it's not a choice for everyone. Yeah, if, if you have thyroid issues or if you have some sort of medical issue that mm. causes you to put on weight that is beyond mm -hmm. your control, mm -hmm. I have all the sympathy in the world for you. However, a large majority of the population, it is a choice. I get that, but I don't think that what sh her question was stupid. Which, which is what? Why are you only asking skinny people, basically? Why, why, why? But that question is stupid. It no, doesn't matter not, who you are. You can ask a skinny, fat, muscular, disabled... The answer is always the same. So he should have just asked some fat and some skinny. I mean, we only saw him ask one person, but just the, the question itself. Is there not, you know how she's reacted to that? Can we not see his full clip? Is being fat a choice? No. Yeah. No. I'm not looking, whatever you believe is what I want to hear. Oh, um, I mean, I don't think so. If you like food, then you like food. Okay. Uh, is being fat a choice? Uh, to some extent, I feel like, yeah. Yeah. I feel like you could be born with certain genetics and stuff mm -hmm. where you can't help it, but at the end of the day, losing weight's a choice. Right. Okay. Losing weight is a choice? Yeah. Okay. Cool. I think that a lot of times the things you, like, do with your body and things that you put in it are a choice. So, what is your, uh, definitive answer? I'm gonna say it's not a choice because a lot of people would not choose for that to be the way they are it, <laughs> it, i knew he was oh, gonna for pause God's it sake, there. man <laughs> and do you know what people are so scared of being cancelled by this woke mob but they, they just won't tell the truth it is a choice i'm not saying you're a bad person if you decide to choose that but you do choose that we're not talking about the exceptions but the exceptions don't make the rule i don't know how many times you have to explain this to people if you sabi now decide to go inside and eat everything in your fridge mm -hmm. you might not put on weight <laughs> But let's say you did. Mm -hmm. Was that not a choice? Yeah. Right. So, is it, is it, what is that? Is that a spider? Yeah. Is being fat a choice? <laughs> no. No? No, I don't think so at all. I, no, yeah, explain. I don't think so. Explain. I think um, that's in, like, your genetics yeah, for some people. Genetics. Yeah. Sometimes it is. Okay. It depends. I, yeah. So, I'm just going to pause it here. So, yeah, I think. Everything you just said is completely right. People are too scared to say what's really on their mind. That's why they're all giggling really awkwardly. And I understand that. I understand genetics, but it is a choice to not then try and do something about it, to not try and go and exercise to lose it if you can. Aside from people that have medical conditions, if you're just fat because genetics and you eat too much, you could try so many different things to try and lose the weight there's certain people that don't put on weight easily right and there's mm -hmm. certain people that put on weight very easily mm -hmm, mm -hmm. i'm one of those people that can put on weight very easily whether mm -hmm. that's muscle or fat i can mm -hmm. put it on extremely easily so i have the kind of genetics that especially in the society that we live in i can get fat very quickly in a week's time if i don't look after myself you'll see a change knowing that i take responsible measures to only intake a certain amount of calories a day and if i decide to have a cheat day i make sure i work out a certain amount in the day Even even if you have thyroid issues, it's still a choice if you decide to eat everything. It might not be your fault that you're more predisposed to putting on weight and you can't really control that. But what goes in your mouth is a choice. Yeah, but there's some people that are, are fat but can't physically can't work out. Yeah, and I get that. it's it's dieting is not always easy as well. It can be very unhealthy no, if you're a diet, certain weight. Dieting is difficult. Dieting is the most difficult part. So the some gym, people is it is difficult for difficult, but that. The choice is still there. Uh, like I said, nothing worth mm. having, anything worth having is difficult, usually. It's not always still there. But the choice to diet. The choice to lose weight if physically 
But we're not talking about the extremes here because we understand people with thyroid issues. Yeah, okay, issues, cool. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah. yeah. If, if you're just a regular Joe Schmo for the, most of the population that don't have thyroid issues, it is a choice. I'm not saying you're a bad person, but you did make some bad choices. I've been there. I've been fat. I understand. I get it. But if you already know that you're more predisposed to put on weight, you have to do something about it. You have to take some personal responsibility and stop blaming everyone else. And not not get upset when people point out the obvious. Yeah. If you decide to go to the gym, it's a choice. And if Mm -hmm. you decide to wake up in the morning and eat all the ice cream, that is also a choice. Again, doesn't make you a bad person, but you did make bad choices. I think that choosing a healthy lifestyle is a choice. Um, I don't know what else to say. <laughs> All right, is being fat a choice? Yes. You want to expand upon that? Why? What, what, give me your thoughts on that. Um, I think your fitness level depends on your habits. All right, bro. Um, is being fat a choice? <laughs> um, it's a mindset. A mindset it's definitely a mindset um it depends like well some people have like eating disorders where they like can't don't really like choose it just like happens <laughs> is being fat a choice uh, absolutely 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 mm, yes and no some people have genetics and like whatever like it's a fact that like lifting changes your genetics really look it up is being fat a choice that uh, depends on the person Obviously, it could be like a, I don't know, physical deformity, mm-hmm. birth defect, but you can always choose to change your habits. Mm-hmm. Okay. Is being fat a choice? Um, I think it depends. On? I think it depends too. Yeah, I think it depends on if you have conditions or not. Okay. I think it's totally okay to be fat and I think you're loved no matter what. Yes. Explain. But no. All right, is being fat a choice? Most cases, yes. Okay, can you see what they've done here? Okay, he's, they filmed he, this right outside a gym. Yeah, they filmed it outside the <laughs> gym. So, like, I mean, these people already understand. They made the choice to go there and work out because they don't want to be overweight and they want to be healthy. Mm. So, all of them should be saying yes. We recognize that people that have issues with their health that can't help it, that's one thing. But for majority of people, you are in control of your actions. Take some responsibility and just own it. That's all it is. Now, to go back to what she said, the girl in the beginning, he did ask mostly thin and in shape people. Mm-hmm. But that doesn't matter because it's an objective truth. It there just was is different it opinions is. there as there well. There were different opinions. I mm-hmm. think most of them were just scared of being cancelled. If you're skinny, you might be unhealthy. But if you're fat, you are always unhealthy. Your bones and your body is not meant to carry that much weight. We're just not supposed to. We're not operating our in our um in our optimal forms. And again, I'm not shaming anyone for that. I understand. We all make mistakes and life can be difficult. But you have to pick yourself up and take some responsibility for it and not post stupid TikToks like that woman. That really is irrelevant. Completely irrelevant. If you want to be fat, that's fine. You do you. We live in a free country. But you don't need to ask fat people for an objective truth that we can all observe. And it doesn't have to be fat people that exclusively let people know that. It doesn't have to be, but sometimes it is good to get the opinions and thoughts and feedback from people who are living through that. But it's not an opinion, it's a fact. Okay, so you could go around and say, is cheating a choice? But then you're not going to just only go up to people who haven't cheated and ask them, you're going to ask both. But what would that prove? We know cheating is a choice because you choose to get into bed with someone Yeah, but else. I'm just saying, I'm just using that as an example of you're not going to really just ask someone who hasn't done it. Why does it matter if they've done it or they haven't? <laughs> Basically, it would, be good to, it would be good to get the feedback from a fat person to see their reasonings as to why they're fat or if it, they, re- if they no, feel no, like no, it, no, if no. they personally feel like it's a choice or if they feel like it's impossible just to know and understand what they're going through, what their thought process is. It does make no sense to only ask skinny people. I get your point of the overarching point. It makes sense of the facts surrounding it. However, it would be good to get the opinion from a fat person. Why do you need the opinion on something that's factual? We have opinions, 
which are subjective okay. and facts I are objective. That. What, what does the opinion do for but the, the conversation? But you're just an opinion from someone who's who's going through it. No, no. But the question is, is being fat wrong? Was that the question? Is being fat a choice? Is being fat a choice? Yeah. Right. Again, we're removing people that have health issues. Yes. For normal people, not no, not that these people are not normal, but people that have that don't have health issues. Yes. Right. For all the, the millions of people that don't, whether I ask a ten year old. A fat person, an old lady, or a disabled man. Yes. The answer is always the same. Yes. So why do I need to ask for the? What does the opinion do? It will still be good to just get the opinion of someone who is what we're discussing. Okay, tell me why it's good to get the opinion. Because it's it's coming from someone who is who is living through that. No, but why does their opinion matter if it's factual? If I tell you that that picture over there is has a black frame around it yeah i don't need your opinion on that because that is a black frame your opinion doesn't i come understand into it. that but i just don't think it's fair to just have all skinny people that's just my opinion but i understand i understand thing? it's not going to change anything the point is the same but i still think that they should have just asked some fat people as well but just to make them feel better no that's, that's, just that's to just to get just to get a different answer and opinion maybe and hear what goes through their minds or what they're going through on a day-to-day as to whether they personally feel like it's a choice or not because you're saying this is a fact but everything in this video was everybody's each own individual opinion and everyone had different opinions so it would have been nice to hear an opinion from somebody who is fat whether they think it's a choice or not because we're talking solely on opinions here we're not that these people asking a question weren't asking based on facts or nothing they were asking for everyone's opinions do you think being fat is a choice that's what it was so yes they're getting opinions from all different people that you think are facts or whatever you can say it's facts but still the overall concept of the video was based on opinion so it would have been good to get an opinion from a fat person do you get it now (laughs) my problem with this (sighs) is that opinions don't matter that it can come from a black person a white person an asian person a fat person a skinny person or a muscular person in the overarching discussion yes of everyday people Mm -hmm. if you're not getting enough calories and you let's say you live in an environment like this you know most people live in normal circumstances we're talking about people in the first world they have access to food some people choose to not eat for whatever reason they choose to not eat that's a choice for whatever reason, people decide to not go for a run, to not go to the okay. gym and to, to eat every single thing in the house and overindulge. That's a choice. Like I said, we're not talking about people that have disabilities or something wrong with them inside. We're talking about everyday people. And for everyday okay. people, it is a choice because in order for a, a everyday person to get fat, they have to go and purchase the food, cook it, order it from a takeaway and eat it. Okay, right. So I understand your point. I understand what you're getting at, but the video was a guy or guys asking people, do you think being fat is a choice? And then the second bit to the video was her saying, why are you only asking skinny people? That's it. Regardless, no, regardless of the facts that you're saying behind it, the concept was based around opinions and that's it. So your facts are irrelevant right now because it's an opinion based video. No. But the premise of the question in reality is not an opinion. It is just a fact. It's okay. an objective, observable reality. Okay, that you but make he was choices. asking for opinions. He, yeah, he was asking in their opinion to see what they would say because it's such a stupid question. Yes, yeah, so then ask a fat person as well. <laughs> if they say that it's not a choice and they all say it's not a choice, would you say that's valid? Some of them might own up and be like, yeah, it's a choice. They're, 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 you've just proven my point. Some of them might own up, which means some won't lie, which means it is an objective truth because some of them would be lying to hide from the fact that it is a choice. Okay. I'm not disagreeing with you. Right. So that my point is asking anyone doesn't matter. You can ask anyone. It does not matter. She's upset because they didn't ask fat people, but it doesn't matter. <laughs> we go around in circles. Yeah, we are. <laughs> You guys, let me know what you think in the comment section. Do you think this is an opinion or a fact? Bear in mind... No, I'm not disagreeing. It is a fact that you're saying, but okay, I'm just let talking... Me rephrase of, that. Okay. Let me rephrase that. Do you think it matters that he didn't ask fat people? Okay. Do you think their opinion matters here? 
Or do you think you can ask anyone because it's factual? Let me know what you think in the comment section. Maybe I'm being insensitive. Maybe I'm not getting what Sabi's saying. Personally, if you tell me that is black, it is black. I don't need to go and ask your brother. I need your opinion. Is that black? Now, he might be colorblind, but then that would be an extreme again, just like people with thyroid issues. So that is my point. But you guys let me know what you think because I'm, 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 I'm not getting this. <laughs> it's not registering with me.